Welcome back guys. So our red velvet cake is just ready and straight out of the oven. I made a little sample for me to show you what the inside looks like. This is what the bottom side looks like. Can you see? All red through and through. So I'll be cutting this just for you to see what the inside looks like and to let you further see how there are no brown patches or bottoms. Now for this one, this is the main cake we used for the video and I'm going to be flipping it now. Still a bit warm but yet yeah, because i'm wearing gloves i should be able to hold it so i will just flip it onto the wire rack now and then i'll turn it here now i wouldn't be cutting this but the aim of showing you this is to show you the sides and the bottom sides can you notice but can you bring closer can you notice how well baked this looks imagine look at this now this was how i checked for doneness see entirely clean no wet patches or anything totally clean despite the fact that it is very well baked you can see that it doesn't look dry and it doesn't look overly moist like wet on the surface it just looks just ideally moist as it ought to be and look at the color so now let's turn it together now because i already oiled my pan and i dusted with flour prior to pouring the butter in it i could actually just flip it and i will have no problems with it coming off easily but just because i always try to avoid unnecessary accidents or anything i always use my offset spatula to just run around the sides slightly to make sure that for adventure there is any part that has friction to the pan in any way i won't have like a rip off on the edge or around the side so i can be sure that the cake is going to come out very neatly and nicely so doing that after doing that i will just simply turn it over to the wire rack see so turn it to the wire rack now and just give it a flip Closer. See that? Whoosh! Isn't this amazing? Don't you think this looks really amazing? Like, look at it from the bottom side. Can you see how it looks really moist? Can you see how the red is evenly distributed? Can you see how the sides have no bones patches? Can you just see how clean and how neat this looks? So for adventure, you want to use this for just some uniced cake, you know, for a client or anything. They would actually be looking forward to dig into this because it looks really appealing. So immediately, this is the trick. Immediately, you flip it. You flip it right back into the pan just because you don't want it to stick to the surface of the wire rack after staying there too long. So then you just gently lift it up and have it like this. So yeah, our red velvet cake is ready. So let's cut this now. Because it's not very easy to cut with a wire rack, let me take a second to get another board. This is another board. Clean. So I'll just leave this on top. And then I'll just use a, a knife. It can be any kind of knife. To so just cut this. Just cut this. Alright. After all, after all said and done, I must tell you for a fact that this red velvet cake recipe is the best you can ever have. Try it out and come back with your feedbacks and reviews. I'll be here waiting to hear from you. So, I hope you learned something today. I hope you're going to try this out. Obviously, I hope you like what you see. As you see already from the video that this is actually an amazing piece here. Color 100%, texture 100%, moisture 100% and I must tell you that taste for a fact is 100% so till next time guys I remain your favorite girl famous dessert view your favorite baker girl till next time guys bye